<laughs> How's it going, everybody? I'm Drifty from Driftful Gaming, and I'm joined with T. Hello! We're going to do another RPG Maker MV First Impressions video. This is on the Great Gaias, and this video is sponsored by Horizons End Incorporated. So, let's take a look at the Great Gaias. It looks cool so far. Yes, this game is a... This game is available on Steam, and um, I will put a link in the description below to where you can get it. Okay, so looking at the options, we're going to turn on Always Dash, Command yeah. Remember can stay on, ATB Speed, max it out, Graphics, Animated Tiles, on, Sync Monitor, FPS, I think we need that on, Lighting Effects, on, Sound, okay, I think everything's about right. right. Yeah, it's probably good, okay. Yeah. New game! The Great Gaius. Play the intro, sure! Let's uh, see what it has to offer. How you guys doing? Grand Arcanum! Alright, some auto run event. This is made in RPG Maker MV. I wasn't sure, you know, looking at the video. <clears throat> Historians have had their theories regarding the beginning of man and the origin of war. However, tomes can be misinterpreted, twisted, and even lost to the test of time. It's just auto run happened to be about the right Ooh, duration. I like this the looks map. nice. It's so I pretty. like the sprites too. I love that tree in the middle. It's awesome. Uh -huh, the sprites are good. The first men once lived in perpetual balance with nature, knowing nothing of greed or violence. Love the trees. They're so pretty. The first men possessed immortality, giving them ageless lives to watch over their children, and the wisdom to guide humanity justly and righteously. It seems like it's timed perfect. <laughs> I wonder how many uh, iterations of this this has gone through. Because I really don't like when there, it doesn't wait for my button press. But their peaceful lives would not last forever. The emergence of a stranger from the East brought magic and powerful sorcery to the mundane world, and with this newfound power came calamity. Uh oh, the music gets sinister. Yeah. Oh, look at the sprite work. Yeah, that's great. Cool. Lighting's good. Grindelwald Maltor, as the stranger would later call himself, corrupted the first men, turning them to wickedness after giving them, la, 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 calling them the Goff, he would use these immortal warlords to enslave the once peaceful human race, creating the first civilization to great- Oh no! Oh, a little bit, you know, when you put names, you gotta give a little bit extra delay for people to get used to the name. The Villadians would be utilized by Lord Maltor in a war of genocide against the elves and the other Free folk of Tinat in an attempt to bring the world under the new emperor's rule. I'm gonna guess this is based off the Book of Eden. Only one man dared to challenge the might of Emperor Maltor and his immortal Galf, a once renowned Meridian general. Uh, the name's gonna slow people down, you know. Yeah. Wait for a button press to be better. The Great War rattled the very foundations of the world and was the bloodiest war the age had witnessed. Printing. Printing brother against brother. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Leading the nations of Tinat with the Warriors of Light at his side, Arthur Graham beat back the forces of Validus, winning the world's freedom, something something or another. For nearly a thousand years, the world has, has lived in a relative peace, but people forget and mistakes are made, and only the dead have seen the end of war. Is that so? <laughs> <coughs> Alme. Okay, At Atreus. We've arrived. Our target's location is within. You want to be Potts? <clears throat> Who's the mark? One, Bertram Rosenberg, a man whose dubious business dealings have reaped a small fortune at the expense of his former partners. Our client is one of those partners. While aligned, their shared enterprise grew formidable, and both our client and Bertram became quite wealthy. Yet Rosenberg steadily squandered what he wealth he amassed. Ultimately, he was overwhelmed by a jealous belligerence as he watched his former partner become wealthier still. In the end, Rosenberg orchestrated a rather sloppy heist and yet managed to steal some several hundred thousand from our client. It seems unlikely that he would be so invested in his target to know like the details of that story. Maybe it's just me, but... Hmm. Maybe he does a thorough investigation before he takes a client. Maybe. 
Ha! Seems like we've become a little more than debt collectors. What's become of the Thieves' Guild that we should stop, stoop so low? Careful, Potts. Remember that I built this organization from the ground up and watched it mature as a father does his child. It would be wise for you to practice some discretion. Your friends would mourn their loss before I would allow my Thieves' Guild to be compromised. We can never be caught, because we can never be seen. I know that, Atreus. There's only the mission and the mark. For me, there's nothing else. You know this better than anyone. Something pots are best left unsaid. I would neither see myself return that to that formal life, nor you. Enough. Let it commence and be done with. I would have us home before evening meal. Okay, so updates, some stuff. Let's look at the menu. Um, a lot on the screen to take in, but if we're getting rid of a status... I like okay. those icons. They're cool. Okay. Uh, inventory. They're sectioned off nice and neat. Potion. I like the icons too. Yeah, they look pretty nice. Yeah. Barlin Mead, Antidote, Lockpick, Journeyman's Lockpick, and a potion. Okay, and then they're just... Okay. Looking at our skills, a rogue has burglary and steal. Bur oh, those are our types, and the skills are sneak attack, massive damage, cost AP, which is, I'm assuming, like a TP. And then steal is probably just its own thing. What about uh, Atreus? He's an assassin. He's got chakra, sneak attack, hamstring, and crippling strike. Okay, L stat lowering moves. Alrighty then. Equipment. Optimize weapon, shield, head, body, jewel, and accessory. Yep, that'll work. Status. Whoa. Okay, so it just changed this screen. That's a lot of stats. Alright. Adrenaline regen. That's probably TP. AP stands for adrenaline. That's what it is. Okay, immunities. Nothing there. Experience. So, Atreus is a level 22 assassin. And Potts is a level one rogue. Hmm. I do notice that there is a space element, which is interesting. Hmm. Primary, Rosenberg's house. Okay. Quest log in here. Biographies. We have this going on. Who is this? Elenia Althorand. Okay. Factions. Record Keeper. This is our save game. Yeah. Cool. So record is our save and restore is our load and erase is delete. Nice menu. It looks good. Options, and we've seen this already. Okay, cool. I like it. It's good. If we hold shift, we can run around. I want to... I, w -A I thought no. always dash was on. Yeah, I thought it was too. If I go to, to my options. Gameplay, always dash off. Oh. I must have turned it off when yeah. I was trying to turn it on. <clears throat> that is a nice house. The tile set looks really nice. Yeah. I like the tile set. Pots, what are you doing? <clears throat> Our target's house is down here. Yes, I don't know what I was thinking. Okay. It, it is locked. Would you like to pick the lock? Moderate chance? Mm -hmm. Well, let's try. Oh, a d20. Roll the d20. You failed to pick the lock. Step aside. I'll take care of the lock. All too easy. <laughs> nice. We should, we should move, move quickly. quickly. I will take the Get upstairs. <laughs> you check the basement. It's as good as done. I'm sure they would both be on the same page. Let's, yeah, let's make yeah. it quick. Yeah. <laughs> the water looks very nice. Wow. More cool mapping and tile sets. Gotta say, it's really impressive. It is. Very. It's locked. Would you like to try to pick the lock? Yeah, let's roll that d20. 14. Picked yeah. it open. Your skill in lockpicking has gone up. It is now two, so let's open it. 250 gold were found. All right. Open the book. What would you like to do? Oh, we can use a tent here and save it here. It's a save point. Okay. That's that's nice. I it's like it. So nice. It's Thank not you for like not a making it a save crystal. Yes, or it's like great. That. It's a book. Yeah, it's, it's it's very cool. Okay. Oh. That's, that is an enemy. Let's look at the enemy, the uh, the battle screen. He here. looks like a dwarf. <laughs> the sizings look a little funny. Yeah. He, he looks like a halfling. <laughs> he does. He's a hobbit. He's a hobbit. <laughs> He's a hobbit. Um, okay. 
Burglary. Can't do sneak attack. I thought we had two party members though. Yeah, we. we Let's try to we steal from the ways. mercenary. We're using an ATB system with some action sequencing. Pot steals block picks. Is that what it said? Here's. I like the animation so far. I like the action sequencing. Let's try our attack. Bang. 49 and an evade. Okay, so he's got like two daggers. Cool. I wonder what kind of uh, hit points he's going to have. Slash. Okay. Burglary. Let's try sneak attack. What? Nice. Okay, I like that. Yeah, that's alright. Gold, potion, water skin. Good combat system so far. Yeah. It's locked, would you like to try to pick it? Yeah, we can get a, you know, a high number. We've got it! Now we're level 3 lock picking. 150 gold again. I wonder, um, if these guys, whoa. There's some weird decorating over there. Um, I don't know. I, I think there's too mu too many pieces of art. Maybe it's supposed to be like a art storage facility. It, it's obviously like some sort of display area. They've taken away all the, like, valuable things like the Nazis did and, and stowed it away, so they just have it all in there. Really? That's my guess. Look at all this fine art and, and, and treasures just sitting around. So we got we've come to an auto run here. Well well, look what we have here. A gratuity perhaps? Easy money if you ask me. Indeed, I foresee a substantial bonus in our near future. Ha! Oh, our missions become all the sweeter. Now then, gather as much as you can. Bolt! Huh? Well, he just disappears. Whoa. Who are you? What are you doing? What are you? Where are you doing? Or what, what? are you? Yeah, oh, what? Blah, blah, blah. Who are you? Like an R. Yeah. Yeah. What are you doing in my house? Ah, dearest Rosenberg, the man of the hour. Why isn't it obvious? I'm helping myself to your things. This, this is an outrage! Wait, did Mathis put you up to this? Yes, he did, didn't he? You, you must understand, I made him. He was nothing without me. He owes me everything. And this, this is how I'm to be repaid? Well, I'm not going down without a fight. Defend yourself. T -t -t Such hostility. Please, curb your brutish antics, dear Rosenberg. I assure you, there's no need for such a vulgar display. What? What? No need to... Yes, no need to fight, you see. You're already dead. Wow. <laughs> I'd say that's shady, but being assassins is pretty shady. Just yeah, yeah that's what you expect. Chapter 1. Orgard. The sun rises. Our return has taken considerably longer than I had anticipated. While the weight of the late Rosenberg's fortune may have slowed us, the weight of his misfortune speeds to fill our coffers. We should go. Leanne will be worried. Of course. To the pub, then. Perhaps we can sneak past her unnoticed. We are world-class thieves, after all. Pub is east of here. Let's go to the pub, then. Some loots. Gotta get some loots. Can we play this? I'll try to keep this as quiet as possible. <laughs> cool. Did we level up our piano playing skills? That'd be cool. <laughs> Shh. Okay, let's go. You be her. Not so fast. You guys sure have a lot of nerve. Oh, you're awake. Come, my darling. Whatever do you mean? Don't you mind, darling me. You know perfectly well I was making a special dinner last night. Oh dear, was that last night? I'm sorry, darling, but our little even evening escapade ran late and kept us from you. I'll make it up to you, though, I promise. No, you cannot make it up to me. I told you, it was a surprise for Pot's name day. Oh yeah, my name day. Hmm. Really, Lainey, I I'm sorry, but it couldn't be helped. There, there. I'll make it up to you this evening. How about it, eh? A night on the town? Just the three of us? But, Potts, your name day. We missed it. It's the most important day of the year. The day your life began. Yeah, tell that to my father. Name days are overrated anyways. Besides, we were busy... working. You're both jerks. 
You always ruin everything. Forget it. Just leave me alone. No, oh, wait, come wait, back. She's an angry woman. Come back. Lianny! Lianny! Lane, Laney. <laughs> I'm gonna call her Laney. Let her go, Potts, and let us retire. We need to rest, and she needs time to settle down. She's so wonderful, though, and we treat her so bad. I feel terrible. Why she doesn't Potts? seem wonderful yet. It seems that there is more to you than just the mission and the mark. Indeed, it seems you also prefer catering to the incessant wailing of women. <laughs> <laughs> dot, dot, dot. <laughs> All right, now, come, my smitten sidekick. Let us retire wearily, though wealthier, to our beloved guild hall. Okay. He talks funny. Orgard Thieves Guild. Ah, a new day. I should go to Lianni and make sure she's all right. I can't believe she made me a name day dinner and I completely blew her off. What's wrong with me? I guess this is my pay. Chump change. Ooh, 62.75? I don't know. We're only finding 2,500 in the chest. Or no, 250, yeah. <clears throat> Private chambers of Atreus Alothor. Blah 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 Whoa! You have sprung a trap of serrated caltrops. Your skill in disabled device has gone up. It's now one. Your acute senses have noticed a trap in place. Would you like to disarm it? Difficulty. Yes. Eighteen! Ah! Ah! Eighteen! Well, we failed. It hit us. Yeah. We're gonna die. We got one HP. It doesn't appear to kill us. Yeah, so I think we're good. I can't die. Let's try to lockpick it. Thirteen, huh? We got it. And our skills are going up. Tonic, tonic. was found. Wow, the tonic. These are different levels of locks out there. <clears throat> there are different levels of locks there. The more you practice, the easier it will be to disarm more complicated locks. Well, we you lost up all your health for a tonic. Well, we didn't die. Hello, bots. Uh, short sword, rusty nail, rod, and a wrapped bow. Um. You know what? I think we're good. Good. Welcome to the armor store. We're fine. And what's up here? This path leads north. Oh, that's you. This path, le path leads north, outside the city of Orgard. It's only used in case of an emergency. In other words, we're not supposed to go there yet. Yeah. What does this guy sell? Oh. What will it be today, Pops? <laughs> Since you're like the hero, I'm gonna be yeah. all the NPCs. Okay. It's a funny sounding guy. No! Ah! Normal mortar and pestle made of some fine stone carving. Okay. Oh no! I heard that the Thieves Guild has chapters all over Tenet. Atreus denies it, but it seems he is far too well informed to operate alone. Hey, how about you move out of the way, you scrub? Oh my gosh. Yep. Come on. That's why I said, oh no. <laughs> no. There's the, two of them, too. They're working together. <laughs> they're colluding. No! Oh, no. They're <laughs> definitely <He's> colluding. Gonna... <laughs> Getting trolled by these NPCs. <laughs> Come on, guy. That's great. You should probably make these Watch, two tiles wide. Around. He better get, get out of my way. Go. Thank you. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. I don't want to get stuck by these NPCs. You're always welcome here, Pots. Would you like to rest? Yes, Guild Mother. We need some, yeah. some resting time. He got Sweet. his face bashed in by a yes. spike trap or something. Okay, we're at full. Let's get let's GTFO of these one tile uh, size long hallways. Hall long hallways too. Long narrow hallways. Long hallways. Lanny. Lanny. I guess I'm gonna be oh, you pots. Him, yeah. yeah. Lanny, forgive me. I'm sorry that I missed. Not about missing my dinner. Pots. It's the fact that you didn't even remember your own name day. Ah, because of my mother's death? I guess it's lost its meaning for me. You can't continue to carry the weight of your father's mistakes. You can't let him ruin your life. I haven't seen him in years. I could care less about my father. You say that, but I think it hurts you more than you let on. You're always so focused on your work. I think you just need time for yourself. Why don't you just take a break? What's that supposed to mean? No. We could go away together. Why don't we just leave? Ah, and go where? Dibbledorf? Sure! I heard it's great this time of year. Don't be ridiculous. And what would Atreus think? Oh, who cares what Atreus thinks? Let's just go. Just the two of us. Uh, this is foolishness. I can never leave the guild. Oh, 
Potts. You're so confusing. It's your so-called adventures with my brother that are foolish. Go on, then. Go to him like the obedient little soldier. See if I care! Laney, we might be late again tonight. What if something happens to me when you guys are gone? Huh, that couldn't happen. Why not? Because I'd never let anything happen to you. Okay, oh, okay. that's it. <clears throat> Find a Celestium Shard. Cool. We just rob- ooh, what's over there? He's robbing his crush. Yep. It's like, I would never let anything happen to you, yoink! <laughs> <laughs> he is a thief after all. <laughs> Let's uh, look at our- oops, items. Celestium Shard. A rare shard of Celestium Rub. Someone may find it useful. Yeah, someone is me. I guess. I haven't found a use for it yet. We can pawn it. That's what we need to do. Steal from our girlfriend and sell her belongings. Mm -hmm. Like a true thief. Leaving so soon? I was looking for you. In my sister's room? Ugh, what? No! I was apologizing. Hmm, hmm. Now that you've apologized, <laughs> can we get down to business? What's the mission? Perhaps you recall the macabre tale detailing the demise of my parents? Yeah, you told me your parents were murdered during the Amanian coup. Precisely. And now, and now I, Atreus Al Thorand, am the last descendant of a dynasty whose origins trace back to Arthur Graham and the founding of nations. It is written that the Althorans were involved in the establishment of the stone city of Amanor. What does this have to do with our mission? Pots, my friend. We leave for Amanor, the very heart of my country. There we will depose Lord Stefan Valthen of the Valthen crime family. Lord Valthen? He is no easy mark. He'll well, he's well known as an adept swordsman. He even won the Orgard tournament not that long ago. Indeed. The caliber of this mark is beyond that to which we are accustomed. And even more odd, the contract itself came from within the Bavador House Guard. The Bavadors? Why would the royal family of Amador want to kill him? They're basically two sides of the same coin. Perhaps Stefan Valthan's thugs, whom are currently tearing through the countryside, have supplied the Bavadors with cause enough to justify action of this sort. When do we leave? Immediately. If we leave now, the cover of night shall safeguard our journey to Andragus. I have a feeling that the high level guy's gonna die. Night approaches, and Dragus is this way. Pots, I recognize that brooding countenance. You have yet more questions about our mission. Look how it's getting darker. I love, look at the, yeah, yeah this is great. nice. The writing's good, the, the tile set's really nice. Yeah. The, the, the mission, mission, I understand, but what does this have to do with your parents? Ah, uh, yes, you see, the Althorans were ardent supporters of the House Phelan, the royal family which preceded House Bavador. I have reason to believe that those who murdered my family were hired by Eric Valthan. And, and so, before we dispatch with Lord Valthan, I plan to motivate him into confessing the, to the plot. In other words, he will tell me everything he knows about the Valthan Syndicate's involvement in the destruction of my family. Not only will we kill the leader of the rival guild, but we may come closer to the truth involving the murder of your parents. We've arrived. Use stealth and let us pass the Amanian guard undetected. Amanian border. The Amanian border. It's been under lock and key since Lord Valthan began smuggling weapons and provisions to fuel his syndicate. Well, it shouldn't be that hard to sneak past a couple hundred Amanian soldiers. <laughs> I commend your audacity, Paws. Although watching you weave through those soldiers unnoticed, picking pockets and slitting throats along the way would be quite amusing. I'm afraid we must delay such mirth. For this is not the chosen path. Instead, we shall traverse a little-known mountain pass nearby. The path in question will hasten this expedition and safely take us to our chosen destination. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's get going. I'd prefer this... I'd prefer this didn't take any longer than it has to. Worry not, Potts. I'm sure Lainey will understand. Not funny. <laughs> I'll scout ahead. You never get to use him in battle. No, he's just like a story dude. he's gonna die. Yeah, he's probably gonna... He's probably gonna die. He's the last you remaining. Take his armor and, and weapons before you get into. Yeah, but he's like not in the party. Oh, he's not. No. 
It's locked. We're gonna try to lock pick it. Uh, we rolled a 15. You picked the lock. Your lo skill's gonna. Okay. We found somebody's mixture. It's a mining vein. Your skill level level is inferior. You cannot attempt to mine it. It's impossible. Cool. So we'll need probably a pickaxe and skill to mine. Same thing here. It's another vein. So we're in a mountain and uh, mountain pass that's got some some ore. We have some random encounters here. Um, let's try to steal. What do we steal from these blobs? Boogers. We steal some goo. Yeah, you got boogers. I stole boogers from the slam. Take this slam. I got slammed by the slam. Bam. Resisted slash. <laughs> but he still died. Bada bing, bada bing. Ah. I like the sound yeah, effects. Good sound effect for a dying Satis slime. They're satisfying. The small crack in the wall just large enough to fit your hand. Giggity, put your hand in. Found a Celestian shard. Okay. You can't go that way. No, I guess not. I guess not. <laughs> Got him. All right, let's attack. Bang. Bang. I like the battle background, check that out. Mm -hmm. All the art in this game is really cool so far. Yeah. Definitely. Tile sets are good. The sprites. Sprite work is good. <clears throat> I gotta check all of them just to see if we can potentially mine something. Random encounters are boring, but I mean, the, the combat system's not that bad. I mean, let's hit escape. Yay, we get to escape. Your acute senses have noticed a trap. Let's try to disarm it, yes. 13, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Ah? Huh? Nope. You have Ooh. sprung a poison dart ch trap. Your skill and disable device has gone up. So, we're poisoned? Do we have something to cure poison? Remove poison. Okay. There we go. And a tonic gives us MP. Potion gives us HP. I don't want to die. Can we do stuff. The corpse has a journal caked with blood, with dried blood. Would you like to read it? Yeah. Last entry. That was over six months ago. Not much time left. The beast has done me in. If someone finds this, please tell my wife Olivia that I love her. She's an Aminor. Hmm. Poor fool. Hey, there's some pocket change here. And we got some money. He doesn't need it where he's gone. Absolutely not. Okay, let's do the record keeper thingy and for our progress after doing that. Yeah. Savings. Another vein. Let's check this. I do or nothing here. Ah, oh, but a battle! I'm gonna try a to run. A battle for you! Time to run. Okay, we are able to get away from slime. They're nice and slow. Cool. What was that? Scared. It just surprised me is all. Well, it's coming, so I better give you a hand. I can handle this. <gasps> it's a velociraptor! It's a dinosaur! Hmm, the beast seems to have a nice looking sword in its back. Do you think you could pull it out? With my skill, it'll be no problem. Uh, okay. Assassin. So you gotta steal. Um, yeah, I bet. Uh, we don't have AP. Let's try stealing. But bang! Ancient sword. Okay, can we steal multiple times, though? Double strike. Ow! You dead. But he hits not nice. You dead. Attack. Um, assassin. Purpling strike. Let's do sneak attack. Yeah, sneak, 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 sneak. Oh, it's gonna be the same. Sneak right? attack. Bang! He evaded it. No. We weren't sneaky enough. Oh gosh. He can take it. Let's do hamstring. I want to see all the action scenes. But bang! Oh, that looks nice. cool. Good animations. That's cool. Hey, that's cool, man. Attack. Bang. Let's, uh, I want to see if you steal twice. Nothing left to steal. Nothing left to steal. Okay, crippling strike. Except for his life. Ooh. More cool animations. Uh oh. Are we dizzy? We, we were stunned. stunned. Or something, yeah. Uh, chakra. Yeah. I love the animations. Good nice. sound effects, too. Satisfying. <laughs> it's very satisfying. Yes, very cool. Sneak attack! 
He keeps evading sneak attack. Like, we can't land a sneak attack on this guy. Let's just do a basic attack. Bang! <laughs> the, the enemy death sound effect yeah. is great. You were saying? Uh, lesson, lesson learned. Now that you've finished fiddling with your lizard, may we proce proceed to Andragus? Shame Yay. on him. Shame! Uh, let's uh, check out that sword, though. Yeah. Pots. Yo. Can you put on this agent sword? Whoa. Two more uh, strength, stuff. one dex. It gives us some critical chance and some reflex. I like how you include these additional stats at the bottom. It's cool. Let's save it, too. Cool. All right. Let's continue on. Prepare yourself, Pots. We approach Andragus. It lies just beyond the narrow furrows of this gorge. I'm ready. Quickly, Lord Valthan's manor is situated on the southern east, southeastern side of town. Okay, southeastern, that's down here. Gotta be sneaky and quick. This looks like the place. Valthan Manor. Wait here. Intruders! Fools. Do you not know who I am? Wait, is that Atreus Altherhand? Ah, my name precedes me, although I see my reputation has yet to arrive. Or if it had, you would be fleeing like rats from a sinking ship rather than approach, approaching like lambs to the slaughter. I pity, you see, because all of you are about to die. Kill this braggart! So be it. Whoa! Oh, look at this little sequence! Yes! Hey, this is badass. What? Did you follow that? Hey, I like that. That was very nice. That's Take note, cool. pots. That's how a man does a job. Instead of just like attacking and doing a battle, do a really cool sequence like that. He's surprised. He's more surprised. That's it. Yeah, I liked it. He just killed them all. He's more than just a fool of a braggart. Oh, wait a minute. I see a little. Let's, why is every chest locked? Just to give you a chance to. Um, are, are we gonna keep rolling a five? Nope. No, you just keep trying. We got it. Elixir was found. What does an elixir do? Uh, it's just like what I thought it would do. Fully heal, HP and MP. <laughs> Your acute senses have noticed a trap in place. Would you like to disarm it? <laughs> yes. Eight. We're dead. Serrated cow chops. D disabled device has gone up. Well, we should be fine. So let's unlock it. 16, I think we got it. Yes. Sovereign's finest was found. What is that? Let's put it on. What? Maybe it's none of these. Okay, wait. What about it if it's something for Atreus? No, what if it's. Woo! Sovereign's finest is... Oh, yeah, it's a drink, of course! Revives <laughs> one character from knockout, 25% HP, and increases strength. Okay. Lock, would you like to pick the lock? It's a simple one. Yeah! Roll the 17. Got it. Okay. Good. Did you get the thing that's in it? Yeah. Did I? No. No. I did not. <laughs> Fade Dust. Fade Dust is... Permanently increased luck by two. Hell yeah. Ooh. Pots, eat that now. <clears throat> Eat it now! Blub blub. <laughs> it's should... one of those things where oh, you Oh yeah, up. I'm just gonna hold up. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. You know what you should do is do the, the transport event to put you up here yeah. when you come out of it. Hold it right there! You will not get through to Lord Valtherin! Or you have to fight this one. Yeah, probably. Assassin. Uh, let's do... Attack! Bang! It's hard. And then... Bang, bang! And then we'll do Crippling Strike. Or you know what? What was the other one? The Sneak Attack? Sneak yeah. Attack on the other dude. Oh, we can hit our own guys? That's oh, not good. That's, that's dangerous. But sneak Attack on my buddy! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're dead again. Oh, well, Pots, you certainly are proving to be a useful addition to this team. Get good. Get good, Pots. That's you, though. Oh, get good, me. You're reading Pots. Except when there's a girl on the screen and then I'm reading Pots. I stink. 
I'm, I'm, I'm a little wussy. Um, let's try to use a Farland mead. Get up, Pots. What are you doing on the ground? <laughs> Okay, cool. No bugs or anything so far. Oh, and there's... I had a feeling it would be a good time to save it. And I was correct. You could use a tent there, too. Auto run going on. Okay. Run, I'm afraid we'll have to defer our discussion of this matter. In the meantime, leave to me... Leave me to deal with the shameless intrusion of these suicidal dimwits. You can be your run. Yes, my lord. I'll take my leave. Pots, no one escapes. Go after him. Cowards! Don't run! So the rumors are true. The Alpha Ren boy survived after all. I have to compliment your brazen brazenness in returning here. But alas, it is for naught. You see, you won't be leaving here alive. I've returned, Vathan, to see that you answer for the butchery of innocence which you've perpetrated, and which has gone unpunished for far too long. Your arrogant, your errant brutality and vile depravity ends today. Ha ha! Don't make me laugh, Atreus. What unmitigated hypocrisy. From what I have heard, it is you who is the brutal one. No you. Your assassination <laughs> campaigns effectuated by th that motley coterie you call the Thieves Guild is no less depraved. And what of my mother and father? I know it was your family who had them assassinated. Whatever you Whatever you claim about my actions, I have yet to take the life of your father, an oversight that will soon be corrected. What happened to your parents was nothing personal, Atreus. It was just business. You should know that better than anyone. My dear boy, your mother and father died because they wouldn't conform to new ideals. Because they didn't stand by and allow the Babadors to usurp the throne of Amenor? Your father acted in the interest of the realm, for the good of Amenor. The Phalans and the Altharans were ruining this uh, this country, and the people hated you because of this. We merely stepped in so as to make things right again. You insipid liar! The avarciousness, avarciousness, <laughs> avarciousness <laughs> of your father led him to betray and destroy my family and the rightful rulers of Amanor. Subsequently, the Vathans and the Babadors became the richest, most powerful, and most corrupt rulers Amanor has ever known. Your father is truly a villain. <laughs> your father and Rams Babador, they too will know betrayal. They too will know slaughter. And before their end, they will know it was I, Atreus Atherand, who destroyed them. I'm coming for, fa for your father once I cast your blood from my blade. You dare threaten me in my own house? You're about to die in this house, traitor. <clears throat> nah. He's gonna die now. No, He's you. Gonna die. He's gonna die. It'll be a permanent death. <laughs> I like insipid. I want to use that word. Insipid. Oh. You insipid fool. The writing in this game is top notch. I love it. It's, I don't it understand all the words though. What I was, was that adversus? Adversiousness. There was one I didn't get. Yeah. <laughs> what does that word mean? I don't know. We can look it up. We should know that. Come on, we, we should know this. Aver no, no, no. Averse, avarice. It Aver comes from, from the, the term avarice. I gotta see what he's got. Ah, he's kind of weak. It, he, he has nothing left to steal. He doesn't hit as hard as the dinosaur. Let's go lower his dexterity. He's trying to pierce us. <laughs> Giggity. Bang! Let's drop his dexterity down. Check. We don't need that yet. Let's just attack him. Bang. Yes, let's. Let's do uh, lower his strength as well. Ba -ba -ba bang. Yeah. It's a cool animation. Double strike. Had nothing there. Um. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba 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 Chakra. I don't think we need it yet. Just attack him. Bang. Mm, sneak attack. This always misses for some reason. Bang! Ooh, Ooh, that was good. Didn't miss that he time. Was a weakling. Yeah, he wasn't that hard. Water skin elixir in comparison to Atreus. That is farewell, Lord Vathrin. I'm only sorry that I won't be there to see the look on your father's face when he hears of this. He's dead. Got him. He's dead as a doornail. Got him. You want to read the guard? Please. Please, I don't know anything. 
You will tell me the name and the location of the man who fled from Val Valthon Manor. I told you I don't know anything, I swear! You are familiar with the Thieves' Guild tactic known as Lanktik, are you not? No, I don't know what you're talking about. Lanktik, or as it is more commonly known, death by a thousand cuts. Now, the choice is simple. Tell me what I want to know, or I will strip the flesh from your bones bit by bit. You wouldn't. I can't help you. I wish I could. I just don't know anything. Ah! Tell me! Ah! Stop! Please stop. I'll tell you what you want to know. The man's name is Iran. Iran Mythos from Talos. Please, I told you what you wanted. Please let me go. I, I need a healer. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> At least it was a quick death. <clears throat> Still mopping up, I see. I know where he is. It won't be long now. See to it then. We'll meet back at the guild when you've finished. Tell Le Lanny I'm... Lanny. I'm... Lanny! Uh, okay. Good luck. <laughs> I'll tell her... I'll call her Lanny. Call her whatever you want. I like the um, map icons. They're the not all map. like... Like teeny little itty bitty... Mm. Yeah. It's cool. I hope I wasn't followed. This is way over my head. Who are those people? Assassins? Could they have killed Lord Vathen? Like how he stays hidden, he comes out of the shadows. Don't argue with me, we need to leave now! You said we'd be safe once you gave the gold to Vathen. What's going on? Damn it, Anna! Vathen is probably dead! What? Then that means we're free of him! Why would we need to run? There's no time, he's... No! <laughs> No witnesses. She's got to die too. Game is brutal. Hurry, Vera, put your jacket on. Oh no! Mommy, I'm scared. Where are we going? Stay away from my daughter. A daughter? No, I. Mommy, who is that? This is. Can't do this. Vera, stay behind me. That man murdered your father. D Daddy, no! <laughs> We can never be caught, Potts, because we can never be seen. seen. And if we are seen, then we have to leave no witnesses. I... Mommy! Forgive me for what I must do. Get away from her! Impossible. Blah. No! Mira, run! Daddy! I'm sorry. No! She's got like amazing powers. All my training couldn't prepare me for this. I could have let her live and took my own life instead, but I didn't. I disgust myself. I wish I had never been born. I can no longer continue to walk, continue on this wicked path. I won't be returning to the Thieves' Guild. Later that day, I wrote a, a letter to Atreus. Can I read it? Your secret is safe. Enclosed is my key to the city. I regret to inform you that I can no longer work for you. My pain following the last mission is all too real. Do not seek to find me, or you will not see me again. I'm sorry, old friend. This time, it's for real. Sincerely, Potts Taylor. That's auto run too, so the timing on that was pretty good. I didn't know what to do. All I could do was run. Run from the sound and screams of that poor crying girl as she reached out toward her father's body. The sight of that blood-covered child is always with me whenever I shut my eyes. I cannot run from my dreams, nor from the sins I've committed. <clears throat> I've killed many people, but never again. Never again will I take an innocent life. I head south to Alheim, intending to catch a ship north towards Sorbithia, the city of magic. I will seek out my father, Cyrus. He is the advisor to the Keeper of Magic, and has a seat on the Circle of Twelve, the governing High Order of Mages. Although I haven't seen him in five years, maybe he can provide me with some guidance, some direction. This is outrageous! Let me through! I must board this vessel! No exceptions! You can't afford it! You're one of the magic folk, ain't ya? You means the price is... Oh, that means the price is double. Today is not the day to test me, bigot. Hey, 
What's the hold up here? I'll pay for him, as long as we can set sail immediately. You're going north to Dupree, are you? Yes, but he wants me to pay twice the amount as the actual cost. Listen here. There'd be attacks on ships along the eastern shores by none other than the watery devil himself, the Kraken. I tell you, if you want to go, you're gonna pay. How much for the two of us? A thousand gold for you and two thousand gold for the wizard. And that's a deal, mind you. Ain't nobody sailing to Dupree no more. We could buy our own ship for that. Captain, you'll get twenty-five hundred for the both of us. Now move aside or I'll move you. Uh, all right, come aboard. But I'm watching you, wizard. Right. How could I face Lanny, Lenny, Lanny, la na na na? <laughs> I gotta car Lanny. After what I've done, I can never go back there again. Burned in Laney. my brain. I'm just gonna say Lanny. You okay. can say Lanny. 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 You can walk. Can you walk? Oh yeah. Oh, I have control. Um. Okay. Talk to the wizard. I didn't get to thank you before. That was incredibly generous of you. Sadly, generosity is something quite uncommon in the world today. You have my deepest gratitude. It was nothing. Don't mention it. What was that? Pirates! We are under attack! Yar! Look out! There was a save book there. I, I probably should have saved it, yeah. yeah. Should have took that cue to save the game. Get up, you filthy scum! You are now prisoner of the slaver ship Goldagha of the Osirian Empire. You will do as I say and work on this ship. Follow my orders and you will be fed. Do not follow my orders and you will be beaten. Beaten did it did. And you will go unfed. Whoever you are, were, whoever you were, you are no longer that person. You now belong to the Osirian Empire. If you work hard, you can live a decent life as a slave. You're my property now. Go rest up. Tomorrow is going to be a long day for you. Ha ha ha. Take him away. Yay. So we're slaves on a ship. We're a slave now. That sounds like not That's great. Fun. That's amazing. Let's uh, save. Now you're going to have to escape escape. I like the turn of events, though. Yeah. I, I like this, this storyline. Um, let's talk to the bosun. Sergeant. Get back to your seats. You only have four hours until it's back to work for the lot of you. That number gonna change later on? He don't wanna talk. These guys don't wanna talk. This guy's wearing armor. Cool. Don't even think about it. Get away from me, you fear. I gotta talk to the purple haired dude. Alright, we're talking to the wizard. No? Oh yeah. <laughs> it's best to remain calm, otherwise those guards will give you another beating, or worse. Where are we? We are within an Osirian slave ship. On its way to the Minotaur capital of si Osiris. Osiris. Os Osiris. Osiris. Yeah. Okay. You were captured along with the rest of us here, and will most likely be sold or eaten, depending on their mood. You don't really think they would eat us, eat us, do you? Indeed, I do. And if you could ask our poor captain, he would confirm. Well, you don't sound all that concerned about the direness of the situation. Who are you? My name is Virgil Dalaman Mythos. I am a traveling mage on a personal quest to learn the ways of ancient magic. At least I was until now. Who's that? Mythos. He said his name. Did you see the screen like flash or mm -hmm. something? It's all like, like a, a white flash. You look surprised. Oh, no, you look surprised. Is something the matter? Oh, he's having like a flash. Oh, because it's his brother. I, the last name, Mythos, is the same. They're related somehow. He's reminded of the girl. Oh. The dude he killed was a Mythos. Right. I think. Right. Okay. And it's then, nothing. You know what? That girl had purple hair too. Yeah. And so does this wizard. This might be her uncle. Yes. It's nothing. Hmm. Well, it's good to meet you, Virgil. My name is Potts Talos, and I'm. Wait a minute. If you're a wizard, can't you use your magic to free us? I certainly could do much to facilitate our escape if I were able to use magic. But, you see, I need material components in order to cast spells. Alas, I have none. The Minotaurs confiscated what little I had when we were brought on board three days ago. I'll take a look around. And if I find something that you can use to cast magic, then you and I can escape from the ship together. Do what you must, but you are weak. Perhaps you should rest first. Yeah. Sure. I mean, does that Why take not? our time? Is that like you said? He goes. 
you only have four hours. I don't know. Right. <clears throat> Here you go, you're unlocked. Now get upstairs and start working, or you'll be spending the night with smelly old Toby. Ha <laughs> ha. And he likes it rough. <laughs> okay. Uh, talk to this dude. Back to work! It's locked. You need a lock pick. We don't have it now. Don't even try it. Get back to work. What about this axe? Yo, can I take this weapon and smash some Minotaur's faces? Don't talk to me! Oh, I'll get in trouble! Ah. I guess we have a place somewhere. I think you're supposed to look in the boxes. You gotta find something for that magic dude, Oh, right? yes. You're right. Found a potion! Don't talk to me! I'll get in trouble! Don't talk to me! I'll get in trouble! They all say the same thing. Hey, found Farland Mead. I mean, they could say different things, but they don't really need to, but... Have you found anything yet? A good place to start would be talking to other prisoners. Well, that's what I'm trying, but they all say the same thing. Back to work. Oh, I miss the woods. You be, you be the elf. Okay. What if I told you I can get out of here and back to you back to your woods? You were to tell me such a thing, I would be very interested indeed. Then listen closely. My name is Potts Talos, and I have befriended a wizard aboard this ship who can use his magic to get us out of here. But we will need to get him some materials so he can cast his spells. Well met, Potts Talos. My name is Kalas Tangralas. I am a druid from the Drakenwood, and I will assist you in any way that I can. You say your wizard friend needs spell materials? Well, I've heard you can create fire from sand. Sand. Okay, let's keep talking to everybody. This guy had a face too. Bruh! Just wait till I get my hands on me on an axe. Oh, I'll bash their brains in! These puny minotaurs won't know what hit them. I'll bash them and mash them and crush them and mush them and ring them and sling them and dash them and slash them and dash them! Hey, quiet down! My name is Potts Talos, and I have an escape plan. If you help me, I'll get you out of here as well. Impressive. Just hand me an axe and I'll make chopped meat of these cows. I don't have any weapons, but I do have a wizard and his magic. <laughs> oh, wizard! Pfft, you're joking. That was a good one. Now really, where are the weapons? This is no joke. We have no weapons. But if we are able to get some basic components to the wizard, wizard Virgil, he can cast his magic. Laddie, that's a fool's plan. If you, can't, if you can't get weapons, where do you expect to get magic stuff for your wizard? If you're in need of strength, and you've come to the right place, the name's Bruger Ironhelm. Put a weapon in me hand and I'll get ye out of here. Burger? Bruger! <laughs> <laughs> the writing is fantastic. I mean, obviously, there's some copy paste. You looked at one axe, but look at the other one. Yeah. Maybe you have to talk to the other guy first. Yeah. No, it's Sand, huh? You gotta find sand. Want some Farland meat. Okay, let's see. The shield. Got a tonic. Go ahead and s save our progress. Yeah. Hmm. Potion. Did you, you didn't look at the boxes? Yeah, I did. Oh, well, obviously I missed something. You looked at the ones upstairs. Yeah. Huh. Well, I found stuff. Uh, maybe have these swords? You would think the dwarf wants an axe, right? Yeah. Like, maybe we need... What does this guy say? Toby like it, Ralph! Hmm. Did you check all the boxes on the bottom? I don't think you checked. Back to work! I'll double check all of them yeah. again. Okay, well, maybe we have to talk to the wizard again and let him know about the druid and the, the dwarf. Yeah, maybe... Oh, wait, wait, wait. He said patch. something different now. Received a cloth patch. What did he say? He said something, but he normally said, don't talk to me. Yeah. But apparently I triggered something by having an item. Have you found anything yet? A good place to start would be talking to the prisoners. Hmm, a cloth patch. I saw one of the guards with a hole in his pants. Maybe you can accidentally show it to him.
Maybe is it Toby? My damn pants are ripped! Confound it all! Hey, is that a cloth patch? Give me that, scum! Upon stealing a cloth patch, the guard dropped a shiny pocket watch. Sure he did. <laughs> because that's how it works. It should have been you lifted, or you pickpocketed, because yeah. you're a thief. Yeah. You stole his. He dropped it? No. You stole it from him. That's what happened. Yeah, I agree. I, I reject the text and put my own <laughs> reality in here. <laughs> Got anything yet? Yep. Shiny pocket watch. I can't do much with that, but maybe that stupid ogre likes shiny things. Oh, so he's like your little hint. Toby likes shiny pocket watch. You trade? Hmm, what do you have for trade? Trade for sand? Hooray! Traded shiny pocket watch for sand. Oh, and we can do sand. The druid can take the sand and make it fire. You gotta give it to the purple pack. Oh, okay. So the wizard can use sand as a region? Oh, yes, I can create fire with this bit of sand. Now here's my plan. Every night before we sleep, they lock us to our seats. Just before morning, the guards change shifts. During the change of guards, I will melt the chains that, chains that bind us. Then, when they return, we attack. Sounds like a pretty solid plan. Let's do this tonight. I'll tell the others. This may sting a little. Get ready. They're coming! All right, back to work! Wait, where are your chains? Yeah! Oh, is he the only one? Well, he's the one that found us. Look at the battle background. No, I mean, uh, you should have your buddy. Yeah, how come, you. the, how come the wizard's not in the party now? We'll try to steal. Hopefully we don't die. Yeah, give me the stuffs. Got a potion. Okay, Potions are good. They, they're going to be a full heal. Slam dunk my face. Take one more hit like that. Yeah, yeah. Maybe not a Let's do a sneak attack. Hopefully we kill him. Oh, where'd I go? Oh, behind you. I'm a little hobbit. <laughs> nice! He's been farted out of existence. Yes. <clears throat> Received a club. It appears I again owe you a debt of gratitude, Pots. Thank you for freeing me. Now allow me to show these beasts the power of magic. Quickly, let's free the others. You gotta give that club to the Yep. Yeah. Well every dog has his day. With his two, I suppose. Hmm. Oh, quickly, let's get out of here before... <laughs> Not so fast! Yes, now we have our team. Look at the sprites. Nice. They look really cool. Yeah. Um, well, we might as well keep getting items. And we're going to evoke fire from sand. Ooh, get that potion. Nice. Rage. We're going to gain a strength boost but lose fortitude. I just want to have him attack. Burn with some fires. Oh, cool. Not bad. Yeah. Oh, he's he got stunned, but he's okay. We can steal from this one too. Give me another potion. I need another potion. Uh, abjuration mage armor. Awesome. Just use fire. Burn. Man, he's got. A really small amount of MP. Yeah. Wow. He can cast. Well, he doesn't have a lot of sand. He's got a three clubs. That last one dropped some clubs. Let's get him cracking. Okay, so we can equip uh, clubs, optimize, double club, club, and club. So we have four clubs. What about the druid? Let's get the druid. Thank you, Pots. Let us find our way out of here. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. You should save. Okay. You have to have a tent to rest there. It says use tent. Have you tried that? Let's try it. I mean, maybe you need a tent, or maybe it's just like... Use like... tent. You don't have any tents. <laughs> what would you like to do? Nothing. Nothing. I want to do nothing. Let's do nothing. Can't. We can't uh, use a tent if we don't have a tent. Can we fight this guy now? Toby gonna give it to you, rough. Oh, I think he dropped something cool. He's, he's got character, so I want to see what he's got. I want that pocket watch back. <laughs> Leather gloves. You should get the pocket watch back from Yeah, him. that would, would be, be funny. Or no, he dropped that, right? Mm, no, he dropped Yeah. No, it was the other guy who dropped it. The guy with the hole in his pants. Ah. Right, and we traded sand, right? Yeah. We traded the pocket watch to him for sand. For sand. Yeah, so we should be able to steal the pocket watch back. That would be awesome. Okay, rage. 
Bang! Hit him with a club. Heal. I wanted to see it. The animations are really spectacular. They look great. Yes, yeah, very nice. Sneak very nice attack. Animations. Oh, sound effects are nice. I like all the sound effects. I like the animations. The battle system's good. You know, ATB is a little slower than CTB, but it works. It's still a good battle system. He's out of MP, so we're gonna have to be. He can shapes shift into a saber you cat. Heal. You gotta heal someone. Yeah, Kalis needs heal. Yeah. Um, I'm actually going to use a potion on on Kalis. Hey, saber. He turned into a cat. Mm -hmm. Now hopefully Virgil does some damage. Um, so what? Now that makes me have stronger attack. Maybe I get unlocked new skills. Oh yeah. <laughs> Satisfying enemy death sound. Okay. Virgil learned ice. Gold. Tonic. Oh, we got the shiny pocket watch. We get the pocket watch back. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm talking about. There's a chance you won't, like, actually steal, so it makes more sense that you would. You gotta kill them all. Do At least I? the foreman. Maybe I gotta fight the foreman. You'll never get out of the ship alive. Ooh, yeah, it looks like it. You got, like, a. Battle. A boss fight. A boss fight. I'm not going to. Uh, oh, you gotta fight the captain. Steel. Like, to the top, probably. Let's try ice. Bang. Bang. Healing. On burger. <laughs> now we don't need to heal yet. Let's do damage, right? Let's just see what his normal attack is. Maybe his normal attack is okay. Would you get him out of town? There's so much damage, I should just have this. Ooh, that's a lot of damage, too. Okay, so, our druid is a wussy, but um, he can actually turn into a, a cat that does good damage. Right. Right. Okay, we're gonna cast ice on the lieutenant. BAM! He dies. And we're gonna do heal on Kalis, because I want to see what it looks like. Is it the same? Oh yeah, we've seen that already. Attack. Yes. Cool. We got Cure, we got some more items. Um, I guess we have to fight them all, or he just randomly bumped yeah, into us. Yeah, he was right next to you. Okay. Whatever, we're gonna take him out quick. Just attack. I think we should be able to kill him with all attacks. If everybody hits him, he should die. Fifty-seven... And a critical hit. Nice! So he's not a complete wussy. If he lands a critical hit... Slave upper ship deck. Did you try and open that treasure chest? I did not, but last time it told me that I needed a... Oh, I guess we got our lockpicks back. Yeah. I don't know how, but... Seven didn't work, four is not gonna work. Did I break the lockpick? No. Failed to pick the lock. Yeah. Okay, I got it. Level nine now. A rusty nail. Wait, Maybe is that a weapon? A... That's a weapon. That's a weapon. Not for him, though. Nope. Or a burger. Nice. He, oh no, we're gonna lose one magic. He doesn't use magic nah. anyway. He could use the club, though. There we go. Awesome. Your acute senses have noticed a difficult trap. You might as well try for it. 16! Disabled! Nice. Oh, great, but we're like... <laughs> yeah, you're gonna get into a couple fights, I think. Oh, you got away! Oh, like a ninja! Another oh, no. trap. Yeah, yeah, whatever, out. whatever, no, whatever. You're gonna get hit. I don't care. Get away, get away, get away, get away, get away now. Is that 50? 50. 50. Does that do 50 damage to everyone everybody? Everybody? Yes. Oh, gosh. Oh. Let's use some potion. Wait. That's 200 damage. I'm trapped. Um. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> we have a lot of water skins. We're good. We're gonna fight the boss or what? Let's fight yeah, the boss. Captain Braun, you maggots, you'll not escape my ship. Die! Oh. Uh -oh. 
above your head. Oh, we're poisoned. I should uh -oh. have used. Didn't notice that. I'm not gonna steal here. Um, <clears throat> here's poison. But let's just try to do some damage. Yeah, maybe the poison's not too potent or it wears off quickly. Um, I should have. I should have used the antidote and tonic on Virgil. Healing, cure. I'm gonna just try to do damage, I think. Druidic, shape shift. Let's try to just put him into a cat form. Blind strike. But he missed it. But he missed. Okay. Okay, poison's not super strong. We're gonna go ahead and put him into a rage. I feel like that might be useful on a boss fight. Yes. Going to cat form. It's enraged. Slamming. Oh, all Focusing that fire, huh? That's a critical. That guy. And I. Th oh, now that we shapeshift, we can use a bite. Let's get rid of that one. Let's see how strong the bite is. The bite. Oh no, kitty cat. Poor kitty got taken out. Okay. Um, this will get rid of one of these guys. Yeah. Um, this will get rid of him, I think. But I'm gonna have uh, a Farland meat on on Kalis. Yeah, pots is too fast. Can't get him. Come back to life with one HP. Bang! Get him out of town. All right. Ice on the captain. Prepare to get iced. We're gonna bite him. Yeah. Yum. Cool. Got one attacking at least. Yeah. We're gonna use a water skin on Kalis. And we're gonna try to bite the captain again. And Burger's gonna attack. <laughs> Burger. And uh we don't have any more oh we have more tonics. Yep, use a tonic. War cry, what does that do? Puts some status effect on us. I don't know what it did. Um, we'll use a water skin on pots. I don't want him to get hit and die. Yes. Bite. Yum. Sleep strike. Didn't work though. Nice try, Captain. <laughs> Um, let's try to heal Burger. That way I can try to do a sneak attack. Might do more damage. Burger needs to be Didn't I use a tonic on... He used it on uh, the main guy, Pots. But no, I used another tonic on... Whatever. I, I think I messed up somewhere in here. Yeah, whatever, I think we're gonna win. Sneak attack! Take him out! Bam! Captain's got a lot of HP, it's good. Good fight. Attack. Okay, and we'll try to bite him again. Bite. Sleep strike. Man, it's a poor kitty cat. He's just getting wrecked. This time, we're going to try to do fire on the captain. See, he's, he's weak to fire. Bam! Sneak attack. Attack. Burn. Got him. Good job. Yeah, level up, we got level three. Learn sleep. We got some stuff, a feathered hat, barley, padded armor. Alrighty, you, that's you. Alrighty, you slaver pirate scum. Listen up, we're taking over this ship. Unless you want to end up like your captain here, you'd better do as I say. Y yes sir, yes sir. You will bring us to shore and find, <clears throat> and you will release these slaves. Cooperate and you will be free to leave. But if I ever catch you in these waters again, I swear to Porthos, I will finish what I started here today. Do you understand? Yes, sir! Hey, Pots. You're just going to let him go? There's been enough bloodshed. Hmm. This is an awesome game. Guys, this game is available on Steam. The link is in the description below. It is pretty awesome. It's called The Great Gaius. Mm -hmm. And the price tag is a little high, I think, but I can see why it... it 
why, why it is priced that way. There's been a lot of work that's gone a into this. The writing is great, the uh, mapping <clears throat> is great, the tile sets are good, the animations are smooth, the battle system is balanced. Like, I can't great think of system. things that are wrong with it right now. Yeah. You know, I'm trying to critique this game, and I've had like two or three minuscule critiques, you know. Um, the, I think back on the ship, there a lot of the people, uh, a lot of the events said the same thing, like, oh, I'm, I can't have talked right now, they're going to beat us, or whatever it said. But they were copy-pasted, they all said the same thing. Uh, they could be customized a little bit more, a few things like that, but that's very minuscule, it doesn't really matter too much in the yeah. long, grand scheme of things. Um, this is going to be where we end our first impressions video um, on The Great Gaius. I s highly recommend this game. It's very good. Um, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. If you like this game, uh, how could we improve this game? What did you not like about this game? I'm sure the dev would like to hear about mm -hmm. that. Yeah. Do you have anything uh, that you think about this game? Do you wanna I think the art is incredible. Uh, the good story sprites. is compelling. <clears throat> At the very beginning, I, find it, I found it a little wordy, personally. I thought there was a lot of... Um, redundant explanation mm -hmm. but that would be my only complaint throughout the whole thing it's very nice the battle system's nice the animations look great the mapping looks great and like i said the story's compelling it makes you want to continue and figure out what's going to happen next so right it's pretty cool the yeah. vocabulary used in it may be a little bit a more a little too little bit yeah, yeah i mean kind of like figure out your audience and target your audience um it's probably the, the reader may not even be able to follow along with all those words. So as awesome as it sounds and as intelligent and like, like it's written so well, but sometimes you have to dumb it down. Yeah. And I know nobody likes to hear that really. Right. Well, it just but, makes it more palatable to a wider demographic, right, which right. is good for you trying to sell your game. Right. I mean, there's, there's a few critiques, you know, the battle system at times can feel slow. Maybe um, switch to a CTB, but you've already put so much in ATB, you're probably not going to switch. <laughs> no. So it's a good battle. It's, it's good enough. Yeah, yeah it's good. Yeah. The animations are spectacular. I, I like the the animations. I like the action sequencing. There was yeah. a couple moves that could use action sequencing. I think there was a double attack that looked like it had no animation or action. The guy just went like boom, and then they took damage. Damage. So obviously you could fill in. This, there's still a few gaps that could be filled in, but. For the most part, even the items had custom animations uh -huh. and custom yeah, it was skills. Really, nice. really, really good um, writing. Maybe a little bit too wordy at the beginning, like you said. Yeah. But I've had I played so many games where the, it was just so worse than that that I'm not even really put off by the length of, of that intro. The timed events. Yes. Time, get, let 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 that be player input or wait make for, it too long. Yeah. Wait wait for wait for input because. Yeah. At some, of, at some of the points, especially when you have uh, the names of characters and you're introducing new characters and uh, people are like, oh, how do you pronounce this? You have to give a little bit of extra time because people are going to have to figure out how to say their names. Uh, like a lot of words, you're going to be able to, people will be able to read quickly and you can estimate and guess how long it's going to take. Yeah. But when it comes to names, it, you're gonna, you can throw off how long you think you need to wait. So if you can get those to where you wait for input, that's a way to improve the game because then you can be sure that you're not cutting off the player from the last mm -hmm. sentence of every paragraph. It's not even that. I mean, imagine if somebody rings the doorbell too, and right. you have to get up, then you've missed that entire section. Yeah, that, all that story. That's so true. It, it's you need to be able to stop it. Yeah, like yeah. maybe introduce a pause button, mm -hmm. um, which you can I do. You can pause globally, but, like even yeah. the ins inside of a sequence, pause or unpause. Yeah. Um, or even um, just wait for input instead wait for of input. Wait, instead of yeah, time. Yeah, definitely. So um, that's our feedback. I hopefully you guys liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, like, favorite, share, subscribe to the channel if you're new here. Come hang out in the Discord if you want to come talk to us. Thank you for all my um, lovely backers on Patreon. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for all the support. <laughs> Bye, guys. We'll Bye. see you in the next one.